beautiful Gary Mulcher's home called Belmont in Stafford County. There's beautiful flowers in bloom. We have a blue crisp sky, uh, lush greens. The gardens are beautiful. Beautiful to sit in, to walk around, to paint. Plein air is a French term and it's painting outside, producing a final product. Most of us paint in the studio and paint from images, photographs. So we are stretching our, our limits by going outside and doing plein air and producing on a canvas what we see in front of us. Painting is my zen. It's changed my life. I'll tell you how other people tell us they see it. They call it a hidden treasure. We have artists that come and visit, um, not only to paint on the grounds, but also to, to look at his work. Gary Melchers was an American artist. He spent the bulk of his professional career in Europe and was incredibly successful during his lifetime. He uh, maintained a studio in New York City, and when World War I was looming in the horizon, uh, he and Corinne decided to come back to the States, and that's when they purchased uh, Belmont in 1916 for $12,000. He was very drawn to Virginia's beauty in general, but this area in particular. We're in the studio that Gary had built in 1924. Um, he was very concerned, as all artists are, with natural lighting. So he designed this studio with a huge northern facing window to give him the even light that he was interested in. And so he would have painted in this room, and then in the three other gallery spaces, that's where he uh, displayed his art. We have the art, we have the history, we have the beautiful grounds, we have the hiking trails. We have, I think, something for everybody. There's so many nooks and crannies, you know, so many different viewpoints, so many textures, different historic buildings, that uh, there's, there's something for everyone to paint. They see the same things in the landscape and in the setting that Gary Melcher saw, and they appreciate the same things. This is such a neat, environment for uh, my fellow art students to come together and do artwork. I want somebody to look at the final piece and say, oh, that's Belmont. It is a jewel and an oasis. We're very lucky to have it. And it's just this peaceful, beautiful spot in Stafford County. Everyone should come and visit Belmont.